case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1929, the United States Supreme Court heard a case involving a Hungarian citizen's application for naturalization, United States v. Schwimmer. The case raised questions about the requirements for becoming a U.S. citizen, focusing on the belief in the Constitution and dedication to the country's well-being. The applicant arrived in the U.S. in August 1921 and declared her intention to become a citizen in November of the same year. She filed a petition for naturalization in September 1926. In her application, she expressed her belief in American democracy and willingness to take the oath of allegiance. However, she refused to commit to bearing arms in defense of the country due to her pacifist beliefs. The District Court for the Northern District of Illinois initially denied her application, but the decision was later overturned by the Circuit Court of Appeals, granting her citizenship. The case then reached the Supreme Court, which ultimately reversed the appeals court decision and denied her naturalization application. The Supreme Court determined that the applicant's pacifist convictions and refusal to bear arms indicated an insufficient attachment to the principles of the Constitution, thus failing to meet the requirements set forth in the Naturalization Act of 1906. The court argued that the duty of citizenship included the willingness to defend the country by force of arms when necessary, and her beliefs conflicted with this responsibility. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.